Hey everybody, it's Lokesta97. Welcome back to more Super Mario Galaxy 2. Last time we started off our adventure, and in this episode, we're gonna start things off by stepping on the the panel and, and driving the boat, and you know, yeah, that 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 kind of stuff. Yeah, it's cool. I don't know. Maybe you guys don't think it's cool. I don't think it is though. So we're gonna say it's awesome. Okay, cool. Thanks for watching. I don't know. <laughs> So we blast off to this. This is the world map. Just point the Wii Remote at your destination. Or you can um, just, you know, use the nunchuck. So right now it's saying that we have enough uh, star power to make it as far as that place. We're not going to go there quite yet. I want to go back to Sky Station Galaxy and get the other star. Um, we are going to be going for 100%, all 240 freaking stars. So yeah, this is kind of going to be a long LP. <laughs> um, I'm really hoping, actually, this can kind of just go along with my Mario Party series that I have been doing with Nick forever now. So, or for a while, anyway. It's not really forever. I don't know. Um, I haven't been alive for forever yet. I'm not old. Anyways, welcome to the galaxy. This mission, you're going to have these chain jumps all over the place. If you think you can just do fail, no, if you think you can just do speedrunning tactics again, you're wrong. You actually have to go the way they intended you to go this time, and I can't believe I actually got hit there. You actually have to go through the pipe. Yeah, I can't believe it either. You actually can't use speedrunning tactics in a Mario game. Like, it's crazy. So what you gotta do here is really quite simple. You just gotta line yourself up and hit all these uh, treasure chests until you find... Come on. Where is it? It's gotta be here. Until you find a Power Star. Or Rainbow Star, rather. You're Rainbow Mario, you're invincible. Run around and just kill all the enemies. Simple as that. One of these enemies, typically the last one you hit, I think. Maybe not. I'm not sure. Yeah. Last one you hit, typically, we'll have the key. Where's the key? Where's the key? Where's the beautiful key? That unlocks that little cage over there. And if I haven't given you a seizure already, hopefully this thing will time out. <laughs> okay. So we talk to him. And he's going to commit suicide for us. So that we can fly away. And now we're over here. So now, um, we're over here by the bullet bills, or actually bonds that bills, as they're officially called. Yeah, I don't know where Nintendo gets their naming either, I don't, I don't know. Maybe they have like a, like, room for it, I don't know. Anyways, if you back the uh, wall kick there, you can shortcut your way up, and you can get a one-up in the process. So I, I would recommend uh, doing that, because you're kind of going to want to grind lies in this game. I'm not going to lie, there are some tricky missions in this game. Not going to lie. Over there is a thing that uh, I don't really want to do quite yet. I will show it off. It really, it's just only. Ow. It's only really for extra points and crap, so. Eh. No need to really show it off. They're in every level. So here you get a checkpoint, something that was not in Galaxy 1, but was present. Um. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe Nintendo's got like a. a thing. A thing. I don't know. What was I saying there? I don't know. Um, so watch out for the cosmic clones here as it's telling us. We're gonna step up here and. Oh my god. Red Marios are chasing after us. Yes, in Galaxy 1, these cosmic clones would, uh. Or one cosmic clone, rather, would race you through a level. In this one, they just chase you around until you do something. In this case, it's going on the screen. And then they die. So. Little changes in between the games that I probably just should bring up because you know I like that and I, I can. Yeah. So we gotta do here. The star is right there, so we have to run like heck over to here. And then we get over here by this piranha plant. This bigger piranha plant. Kill him. And we get another key. That's gonna unlock the star for us. 
and then the beautiful star music is gonna play. You actually have to duck down here though. Else you'll die. Don't die, kids. It's bad for the ecosystem. I don't know. Let's just get our get the star. Okay. Yes. Let's just get the friggin' star. Cool. So after you get a star, um, this cutscene is gonna happen. I plan on just cutting this out, but he does say something here, so... Yeah. He's just saying that if we have a friend, we can use them, and they can just, like, collect coins and stuff. And, uh, kill enemies and whatnot. But, Mario's the real hero, so we don't care. Anyways, that's all we can do with Sky, Sky Station Galaxy for now, so how about we head over to here? Yoshi Star Galaxy. Awesome. Coolios, awesome. I'm excited to do it here. Alright, mission number one, saddle up with Yoshi. Yeah, they introduce Yoshi, frickin' second galaxy. So, you know Yoshi's uh, gonna be in this game a ton. Huh. And I gotta say, I am a big fan of the music here. I'm just like, listen to the soundtrack for a second. That's awesome. I'll, I'll shut up. Ow! But yeah, just get the- how awesome- uh, Excuse me? Apparently I suck. Okay. Thank you. God. How hard was that? Not really. Only to a player who freaking sucks. So we hop in the say and it's Yoshi for the win. Yoshi has from an egg. And in an extremely um really questionable way. I don't know. So we just hop in his back and he can do the flutter jump. Yeah. Really awesome! We have Yoshi! Freaking Yoshi! Okay. It is Yoshi! Has not been in a Mario game since Super Mario Sunshine. Wasn't even playable in 64. Well, actually, he was. Actually, he's been in every one of these games, actually. He was in 64. He was in Sunshine. He was in Galaxy, and he's in this game. In uh, 64 and Galaxy, though, you can't play as him. But he is in those games, uh, kind of hidden. So, Sunshine and Galaxy 2 are the only ones where you can actually play as Yoshi, though. It's kind of cool. Um, so, how about we just eat this guy and take his money? Yes. I don't know. So, Mario, if you're Mario running through this mucky crap, you will be really, really slow and you can't attack or anything, but Yoshi can just trout right through it. How about we finally show this off? So we have to just kill all these guys before the time runs out. Not really that hard. You just pointed an enemy, by the way, to uh, eat them because it's just press B. Don't actually think I even explained Yoshi's control. Hey, whatever. You get three one ups from that. So yeah, this uh, game. Oh, no, 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 no. Okay. Was close. Yeah, this game, um, money or extra lives are easy to come by. Like, if you get one game over in this entire game, you fail at life. Really? Like, so friggin' easy to get lives. So that volcano is gonna shoot out a crap load of star bits. That'll actually get us really a one up, actually. Yes, 100 star bits is a one-up in this game. Galaxy yeah, 1 was 50, but in this game it's, hey, 100 for whatever reason. Uh, oh, kill the enemy. So on this little planet here, we just gotta find this launch star, which we successfully found. Really not that hard. And we shoot back off with Yoshi. Cool. Now that we're here, let's read things, like the sign. And Yoshi's nose is going, what's going, sign, that was really weird. Okay! 
Yeah, see, that was son was just telling us, um, quite simply, how to flutter jump with Yoshi, as if you couldn't figure it out. Because that's how you do it in every other Mario game known to man. Oh, shoot. That's how you do it in every other Mario game known to man. So, yeah. Which apparently I suck! God, I can't believe I freaking got hit there. Ah. That is just, just awful. So, uh, we eat these enemies. Don't really actually need to eat them. You can just skip by them. And you do that with Yoshi. Put you over here. And you can launch Star off. To this planet. Which is actually the last planet of the level. Of the level. I am so stupid. Okay. So we have the checkpoint, and uh, we go over here. Do that. And look, it's actually Goomba. We've actually seen Goombas normally, but I don't know why I didn't mention it until now. Yes, there are Goombas in this game, except for the Octo Goombas are, whoops. The Octo Goombas are just the more common enemy in this game. Um, The Goombas really aren't even that common. Don't really know why they did that, but hey, I am not Miyamoto himself. I don't get why he does these things. I don't know, maybe he's got like a a weird fetish of blue enemy creatures and I don't know. So if, when we backflip with Yoshi, we can actually get onto this thing. Ride it all the way up. Kill that What? I suck! Okay, let's just get Yoshi again here. And just. God, how did I freaking. Seriously! How did I get hit right there? Really? What the hell? How did I get hit there? Seriously! He wasn't even. Ugh. Apparently, I need seriously serious help at video games because I suck. You can just easily stomp on that guy, so don't try moving or anything. It's simple. So you can't tongue those guys, which sounded very, very wrong. I apologize. Instead, you just have to either jump or spin them. Really, really simple. And then you gotta go up here with Yoshi and get the star. And then that star has to go up there because he thinks it's cool or something. So you just gotta be cooler and get the star. And you can see a pretty cool animation with Yoshi and Mario. Awesome. Awesome shush! I don't know why I just said that. I don't know. Sorry. <laughs> so, settle with Yoshi has been completed. I believe we're gonna see a cutscene here though. Are we? No, but we're gonna get to go there, and we're not gonna go there yet, though. So who cares? All right. So yes, Yoshi is now on our nose, like some kind of weird booger. I don't know. So our game has been saved, but I think that's enough for this episode. So next time on Super Mario Galaxy 2, we're gonna finish up Yoshi Star Galaxy. See you guys then. Bye.